Peace and blessings to all. Happy Independence Day to all. Um, today I'm going to just read a few words from the scripture and we could talk about it. Um, so the word of the day is wisdom. Because you know? there's a difference between wisdom and understanding. But well, I'm focusing on wisdom. Hopefully you guys enjoy this. You could follow along through with me as I read. I'm going to post it on the screen so you can see it. All right. Okay. This chapter is taken from Proverbs chapter 7, verse 1 to 7. Okay. Here we go. Okay, now it's steady. My son, keep my words and lay up my commandments within thee. Keep my commandments and live, and my laws of, as the apple of thine eye. Bind them upon thy fingers, write them upon the table of thine heart. Say unto wisdom, Thou art my sister, and call understanding thy kinswoman, that they may keep thee from the strange woman, from the stranger which flatter it with her lips or her words. For at the window of my house I looked through my casement and beheld among the simple ones. I discern among the youths, a young man void of understanding. So I wanna say something too. You don't have to be the smartest person. You don't have to be the, the most wealthiest person either. As long as you have God and you're just being simple, you know what I mean? You're not prideful. God could use you, you know, because it's the simplest person he used. That's why he said young man, you know, and um, God will use the weakest person to shame the most prideful person. So always be humble, y'all. That's the best way I could really put this. And it's good to be obedient when God is telling you something. It's good to listen. Because it's the least we could do. You know what I mean. God is saying. Keep his words. Uh, keep follow his commandments. You know. Because it's, it's simple. God just keep it really simple for us. And uh, that's a very big God. And for him to give us. Just basic instructions. And we can't follow it. It says a lot. You know. You know, we all make mistakes. I said it before in my previous videos. And none of us are perfect. And every day is a battlefield between your spirit and your flesh. So God is saying, we must keep his commandments and live. Because without his commandments, we will not get too far, you know, before death con condone you or, you know, or condemned you. And we are to protect the law of God as the apple of, of our eyes. You know, we are to bind them upon thy fingers and write them upon the tables of our hearts. And we are to say to wisdom, the art our sister, and to call understanding thy kind kinswoman. And we are to we have to be discerned and be careful of how we use our words, not using flattering words, and be truthful and wise. For at the window of my house, I looked through my casement and beheld the simple ones. I discerned among the youths a young man void of understanding. So, ladies and gentlemen, we don't want to be void of understanding, you know. People are very sensible, too. And we ought to just 
In everything we do, we are to include the Most High God. In everything we do, we gotta, it's just like the breath of life, right? Without that, we're nothing. We want it, we, we become dead, you know? So that's, that's from God himself. And, you know, that's so much, that's how much he love us. Like, cause there's a lot of times we do the wrong things and God don't destroy us. He'll teach us a lesson, even if it means to embarrass us or to discipline us out of love. Cause God said those he, he love, he chase it, right? So it's just like that one, he, he could have a hundred sheep and one of them is lost. He's going to do whatever it takes to get that one because you already have the 99, you know what I mean? So it's just so, it's so sincere and so true and so powerful. I thank God for the wisdom and knowledge to, and the free will to choose what we choose. And, you know, for God to be so merciful to give us the opportunity to choose and not force us. You don't find that anywhere. That's very, very rare. And it's good to cherish it just like he cherishes us. Well, I hope this this word was a blessing to everyone. And take care and God bless. Be sure to um, like, share, subscribe. And you can reach out to me too if you, if you want. Peace.